So on this the eve of the National Refugee Rights Convergence, we've had a significant event already in that we had our, our request for visiting at Yonge Hill denied. Hello, it's Alex. And these are four requests we ask to visit people that we visit every weekend. I've got your visit application form for the 26th and 27th of April here. Yes, great. Um, unfortunately, um, we won't be able to facilitate the visit this weekend. We were given no reasons other than operational reasons and we were told that DIAC supported this decision. Oh, okay. Um, so we can't visit this weekend? What, why is that? For operational reasons. What, what, what are the operational reasons? For operational reasons, it's all to We think this is really disappointing because one of the main reasons that we go to detention centres um, during the convergence is because the government has from the beginning sought to keep detention centres separate from the majority of the populace so that their policies and the people that they're enacted on are kept hidden away. And so, you know, that's one of the things that we want to do, to go out to connect with refugees. And so it was a very disappointing decision that Serco um, seeks to keep us separate from them on such a momentous occasion for the refugee rights movement. Well, it was basically the right of the the, the refugees inside the Pelta receive visitors? It normally is, yes, but for, for operational reasons this weekend we're not accepting visitors. I think they want, they're sort of seeking to keep the disconnect between what's going to be happening outside and what's happening inside the centre and there already is a really large disconnect because the architecture of Yonge Hill Immigration Detention Centre is such that you can't see refugees and to actually see people inside you have to climb up onto a hill so it's sort of an architecture of secrecy really to keep people separate and that allows the government then to manipulate the way um, the the way they're represented the way asylum seekers and refugees are represented to the public and and manipulate that image because most people don't know any different